Um, today's Copion on episode is about how to deal with your exes. Because a lot of y'all don't know how to deal with your exes. Number one, they your ex for a reason. Something went bad in the relationship to make y'all not be together anymore. Number one is they cheated. Number two is y'all didn't go right together. Number three is y'all didn't listen to each other. Blah, 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 blah. They didn't eat you out. You didn't suck dick. Blah, 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 blah. Something they did that got on your nerves. They was too thirsty, too clingy. It's always something. But the end result is they're your ex. Y'all not together no more. Y'all had a big fight. And then y'all stop fucking with each other pretty much. But... That's normal. Some of y'all be fucking with people you know is not good for you. I covered that in another video called Why people get in relationships with people they know are not good for them. And so I already talked about that. But y'all be fucking with your exes. They your ex for a reason. Alright? They put a bit it's a big X on them. Like DMX to X. X marks the spot. Don't fuck with them. When they cross something out on a test, what the teacher put an X on it, right? When I'm crossing something out, they put a big X on it. It's void. Don't fuck with it. But some of y'all be removing the X and still going to fuck with people that you know because you just had a bad relationship. You know how the relationship is going to turn out. But you still want to fuck with them. And you still think that, oh, it's something magic. We can still get together. Um, Maybe if they change. Maybe if I change. No. If y'all broke up once... It's an 89% chance y'all gonna break up again and have the same exact problem. Y'all be fucking with people and end up having the same exact problem. I know a lot of my exes, I, I got an attitude, you know what I mean? And it used to be horrible when I was younger. It used to be horrible. I did not give a fuck about nothing girls said. I wanted what I wanted. I took what I wanted out of the relationship. So my attitude was crazy and I fucked up a lot of relationships. Especially when I fucked with a lot of nice girls. Like, I did, I probably made a lot of nice girls bad bitches, just off shit that happened, I mean, because I like to play mental games, you know, nigga, we, we're not going to talk about me. It's the reason I'm able to give this advice. I was once, you know, the demon. <laughs> but, yeah, y'all be in relationships that ended badly, and then you want that old thing back. Stop wanting that old thing back. It's the reason why it's the old thing. There's so many people out here you could fuck with. So many new joints you could go get. So many new flows. If you don't want a relationship, don't be in a relationship. Be single. Just talk to people. It is some boys that don't want to just jump into a relationship. And I know it be feeling like that to your girls sometimes. That niggas just be wanting to jump back into relationships and shit like that. But it is some people that just want to chill and be around with you and all that. So, give them a chance. Stop fucking... With that old joint. Yo, somebody get my fucking phone. Put that shit on mute. I'm trying to be professional here. It's a quiet set. Yeah. Yo, get the... F Fuck it. Anyway. They your ex for a reason. You know? I got exes. I cut them off. They cut me off. I laughed. Because that's the proper thing to do when you get cut off. Just laugh. If they don't want you, they're not going to want you. And nothing you can do change their mind. You can't change people. And that be problems people be having in relationships. You can't change the person you with. Get that out of your mind. They can only change if they really love you, if they really fuck with you. Then a nigga will change. Especially us boys. We are rotten. You can't change us. And dude, you cannot change that girl. If she got an attitude problem, if she's moody, if you really want to be with her, you adapt. See, people be trying to change. You know, you adapt. Adapt is just changing a little bit. Now, I mean, you able to go back and forth. If you really want to be with that person, you're going to find a way to be with them. If you don't want to be with that person and they don't want to be with you, it's not going to happen. Relationships take two people to be in a relationship. And a lot of y'all be fucking with people that... Yo, opposites do not attract. I'm going to tell you how this. Opposites do not attract. You want somebody that knows you. You want somebody who thinks how you think. Because imagine, all right, 
They know all the stuff you like. So they're going to do that for you. They're going to plan something special for you. Catered around you. Shit you like. You can't have that when you fucking with the opposite. Because they're not going to care nothing about you. They didn't take the time to learn you and all of this stuff like that. And people that attracted each other, opposites, you can't be that way. You got to have somebody that's similar to you. And a lot of y'all just be trying to get into relationships with exes that are just bad for you, you know? Oh, this shit look hot. I might use this shit for the video. I like this effect. That's the light flickering, so you know. That's about to be my time, ladies and gentlemen. It say X for a reason. Put the X over their ass. If they really want to be with you, they're going to find out a way to make it work. They're going to cater themselves to you. They're going to adapt to your needs. Stop fucking with people that don't fit your needs and your wants. People be fitting your wants. They be cute. They be popping. They fit your wants, but they don't fit your needs. And that's copy on exes. I'm going to see y'all next episode. I think I was supposed to do the niggas like Chris Brown. I'm about to do that shit right now. We grinding. Grind. Killing you niggas. Bang, bang, bang. Copy on. See you next video.